today on Florida Sport Fishing. Beautiful, look at this, fins are all flared out. Get yourself some of that right there, baby. Gamp on the gold, black fin snapper. Nice big fat 30 pound black fin and a mutton. Stuff like this only happens at Pulley Ridge. Ho ho, what on? CV Boats presents Florida Sport Fishing. Television for the avid angler. Powered by Mercury Marine. Oh, yeah. Got one on, got one on. Oh, yeah. There's a sailfish, already got a bite. Ridiculous. Another one on, another one on. <laughs> That's what it's all about right there. Nice jump. Oh, look at that, look at that. Florida Sport Fishing TV proudly endorses and utilizes Ghost, the global leader in boat security, monitoring, tracking, and surveillance. Frigid Rigid, from 35 to 300 quarts, the finest coolers and freezers on the water. VMC Hooks, tired of missed strikes? Fish the hooks the pros fish. Fish VMC. Motor Guide, the most dependable trolling motors on the water. Bio Green Clean, the first and only eco-friendly, heavy-duty, multi-surface cleaner that actually works. Hey guys, I'm Captain Mike and you're watching Florida Sport Fishing TV. We're aboard the legendary Yankee captains fishing out of Key West. We're out here at Pulley Ridge catching some really quality fish. How about that for a red grouper? And on the jig nonetheless. You guys know we come out here every year, film an episode, usually focused on deep dropping off the ledge here with electric reels, power assist reels. This year, this trip is different. We're fishing up on the bank, shallower water, two to 400 feet, all manual gear, no electrics, and both bait and jigs. And that's what's super exciting about this fishery is being able to catch quality fish on nothing more than a piece of metal. So we're gonna get this guy on ice, get him tagged, Drop our jig back down, see if we can get another one. So unlike the traditional high-speed vertical jigs, like the Williamson Benthos and Abyss type of jigs that are really slender and designed to really race through the water, you know, as you're retrieving them, you want that jig to race through the water column. When you're targeting these bottom fish out here on this bottom, it's a completely different scenario. It's more about keeping that jig right in the strike zone from right off the bottom to 10 to 15 feet off the bottom, no more than that. And it's more about just fluttering it, just jigging that jig up, letting it flutter back toward the bottom. And that's where these big eight and 10 ounce hammer jigs really shine because they fall, you know, kind of horizontally and just wobble right back toward the bottom. And because it's heavy, it's easy to keep that jig really close to the bottom, especially when you're drifting along like this. You know, if you're using a light three, four, five ounce jig, it's tough to keep it where it needs to be. So while it's a little bit harder to fish that heavier jig, certainly it's gonna pay off because obviously your bait's gonna be in that strike zone for the maximum amount of time. That's it, that's all it takes right there. Boom. So that jig just hit the bottom, just gonna start bouncing it right off the bottom as we drift along here and the jig raises off the bottom every few minutes i'm just gonna pop it into free spool connect with the bottom again make sure i know exactly where my jig is at all times keeping my finger on the line a lot of times these fish will hit it as that jig falls back toward the bottom so you really want to be in touch with your jig all of the time so back into free spool boom back to the bottom get a little bit of this slack line that's it. It's that simple. Now it's interesting, you know, we're in this area, Pulley Ridge out here, super unique area. Rarely will you see recreational fishermen out here in smaller boats. We're well over a hundred miles west of Key West. And I'll tell you just a spectacular, spectacular fishery out here year round. Scamp. Scamp. Scamp on the gold. On the gold check. About 400 feet here, got a long way to go. Let's talk about tackle for a second, guys. You'll see a wide variety of rods and reels, seven foot, eight foot, rated for 30 to 50 pound line. 
30 pound braid, 40 pound braid, 50 at the very, very most. You can see I'm just getting to that mono top shot and you've gotta have that on there for the elasticity. You know, when you're fishing straight braid, there's no shock absorbing factor. So you've gotta have that mono. That looks like a, is that a mutton or a ham bone snapper? Nice ham bone. Also called a black fin snapper. You can see that little black right there on his fin. Otherwise known as a ham bone. Coming up from such deep water, air bladder expanded there. That fish is not intended for release. There's only one place it's going. In my cooler. Mercury engine tap. Fuel efficiency you can rely on. It's good to have Mercury behind you. It's your turn to score big. Book a long range adventure aboard the legendary Yankee Captains. Fish virgin waters more than 100 miles offshore for exotic queen snapper, trophy tilefish, monster grouper, and more. With a lifetime of experience, let Captain Greg Mercurio and his dedicated crew put you on a hot bite. Fish around the clock or just relax. With full galley and huge fish boxes, all you'll need to bring is your appetite for action. Now sailing from Key West year round. Another one on the jig. That's true for Dynamo. Yeah! How's that for a sea monster? Chaos. Gear matters. Shop online or visit our new superstore for everything fishing. Accomplished anglers recognize King Sailfish Mounts as the industry leader. What started as an effort to increase conservation awareness has evolved into a challenge to handcraft the most lifelike mounts available. With a rich combination of lacquers, pearls, and iridescence, we reproduce the most striking colors imaginable, bringing back both the memory and the thrill. At King Sailfish, it's all about catch and release and preserving our sport for future generations. Visit us at kingsailfishmounts.com. Speed and acceleration you can rely on. It's good to have Mercury behind you. Hey guys, if you're just joining us, we're aboard the Yankee Captains. This is a 100-foot aluminum head boat that sails out of Key West. Captain Greg Mercurio at the helm. These guys have pioneered dry tortugas bottom fishing for almost three decades, almost 30 years. These guys just mastered the art of fishing the tortugas for yellowtails, muttons, big roofers. A few years back, Captain Greg decided to push the envelope to really stretch the boundaries and started to come out to this new area called Pulley Ridge. It's well over 100 miles west of Key West. And I'll tell you, what a unique fishery. Now, if you can imagine, there's these really vast plateaus up on the edge, up on the bank is what we call it. And there's just a, a, an array of life. There's all sorts of coral on the bank. There's a lot of grass, almost looks like, a, like kelp, you know, a really unique type of vegetation. And the different species out here will relate to the different depths. I'll tell you, you never know what you're gonna catch. We had a lucky angler already slayed a super slob of a wahoo, might be pushing 70 pounds. We've picked away at some nice black fin tuna. We've had some nice muttons, some really nice red grouper already, along with a, you know, a variety of other species thrown in. And we're just getting started. It's the first morning of the first day. We left yesterday afternoon, steamed all night long, we're probably about a buck 10, maybe 120 miles off. Got started this morning. Gorgeous conditions right now. It's a little bit slow, but you know what? We're not worried. We've got all day to fish. We're gonna fish throughout the entire night. We're gonna fish all day tomorrow and well into tomorrow night before we finally depart back to Key West. So stick around. We've got a lot of action coming your way. Coming down. Excuse me. Good fish. You know, when you're hooked up on these head boats and there's multiple fish on, you really just need to work together. You know, communicate, talk to your neighbors, talk to the guy to the left, to the right. 
Everybody's here for the same reason. Everybody will work together when you put more fish in the boat. Eight foot cast rod matched to a Daiwa. Saltiga size 50. Loaded with 30 pound diamond braid. And right now I'm getting schooled, worked. A lot of guys are mistaken. They think everybody that comes on these long range trips, you know, is here just to load the boat. You know, in other words, to meet fish and catch as much as they can. And certainly we want to, but there's so much more to it. You know, it's the camaraderie of fishing with 20 anglers, you know, limited loads, great crews on great boats, spending two or three nights out here. You know, it really is an adventure. So there's much more to it than just what you catch. You know, that's just the bonus, the icing on the cake. That's a pretty sight right there. Right now we've got a pot of sailfish off the port bow here, just milling around up on the surface. I mean, this is just a world-class fishery out here for demersal species and pelagic predators. I got a mutton and a tuna. Doubled up, baby. <laughs> Woo! Drop down a bait, hook the mutton. Beautiful mutton. That VMC 70 circle hook right in the corner of the mouth every time. Look at that. Sinker literally just totally wrapped up around that fish's tail. Hooked the mutton. Blackfin probably saw that sinker shining, just cruising through the water, came up, maybe swiped at it, who knows. But the end result, nice big fat 30 pound blackfin and a mutton. Stuff like this only happens at Pulley Ridge. Rigging Station, presented by Diamond Fishing Products, the finest monofilament, fluorocarbon, and braided fishing line in the world. Check it out, guys. On this episode's Rigging Station, I want to talk to you a little bit about selecting the perfect braid for long range, deep water bottom fishing. For consistent success, you really need to spool with the right line. After years of experience, I've narrowed it down. 30 pound diamond braid, absolutely perfect for my snapper outfits. 50 pound diamond braid, the right choice for my power assist deep drop equipment. These lines are ultra thin. That means minimal resistance in the water column and maximum line capacity. Both really important factors. Braid is super strong. You know, you just can't break this stuff. That's for sure. It's super sensitive. Probably one of the most important factors for being able to monitor your rig and your baits and knowing exactly what's going on in deep water. Stay away from that 80, 100 pound gear. You're not out there targeting swordfish. You're not going to apply that much drag pressure anyway. You don't need that heavier stuff. By fishing with the lighter 30 and 50 pound gear, you're going to have a much more successful experience. You're going to put more fish in the boat and you're going to enjoy yourself. The award-winning Z Performance line from CV raises the bar. It's not just fast. It's not just fuel efficient. The CVZ is the entire package. It offers the perfect balance, safe, predictable handling during hard turns and at high speed. And most importantly, the Z stays on plane at lower speed so it can comfortably handle anything Mother Nature can dish out. Experience the exhilarating ride of the CVZ. Schedule a sea trial today. We're gonna try out this new folding fillet knife from Bow Blade on these big grouper. We're gonna try to gut them and see how this thing works. Oh man, like butter. I mean that 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 doesn't get any easier. Golly, unbelievable. Right through like butter. I love the new gut knife from Bubble Blade. It's compact, the best of all. It's like a pocket knife, man. You just close that thing up and put it away. Love it. Great little knife. When you want to get away from it all, to a place where you can do everything, or nothing at all, surrounded by natural beauty and all the modern amenities you might desire, then you'll want to be here, at the Wannabe Inn, on the beautiful shores of Minnesota Key, Florida. To plan your escape, log on to wannabein.com. Joey Accardi Chrysler Dodge Jeep Ram reminds you that before you can do this, you have to do this. And before you can do that, you're going to need this. Save thousands on every new Ram truck at Joey Accardi in Pompano Beach. 
family owned and operated and bringing South Florida our best deals for over 25 years. So before you can do this, do this. And before you can do this, you have to do this. Visit joeyacardicdjr.com. One thing that's really important to remember out here is finesse. Even though a deep water, relatively heavy tackle, there's a lot of things that could go wrong. So you really need to take your time fighting these fish, especially getting them up off the bottom. Obviously, the higher in the water column they are, the easier it's gonna get. And ultimately, if they're big roopers, they'll bloat and they'll float. But initially, it's all about finesse. You know, apply as much heat as you can, but don't overdo it. You'll pull hooks. Lots of things could go wrong. Just take your time. You came a long way, drove a long way. 12 hour boat ride. I'm gonna enjoy every second of this fight. It is hot, you've gotta stay hydrated. I mean, it's so important if you wanna stay at the rail all day and get maximum fishing time. You better be drinking. You better be drinking lots of water. Not beer. No, that's the worst thing you can do is drink beer. Well, worst thing you can do out here in the middle of the day. Out here in the middle of the day. It's 110 degrees. Right. There we go. You got him coming, coming out. now. Yeah, yeah, now that he's coming up, should be getting a little bit easier. I'm just a little bit afraid of that shark. Couldn't tell you what it is at this point. You know, we were talking about that earlier, the variety out here. But the nice thing about it is almost everything you hook is a great fish, doesn't matter what it is. You can guess, but I've been wrong so many times. You think you know what it is, but it ends up being something else. Let's take a quick break while we're fighting this fish. Check out our gear guide section and we'll be right back. Gear Guide, presented by Diamond Fishing Products. The finest monofilament, fluorocarbon, and braided fishing line in the world. Hey guys, on this episode's gear guide, let's talk a little bit about organization and efficiency. Really important on any long range multi-day trip. I'll tell you, I used to bring a truckload of gear that I never used. I've since smartened up. I've refined my tactics. I've refined my tackle. I use these orange Plano boxes. These things are the bomb right here. Plenty of capacity. They're weatherproof. Okay, super important, easy to carry, easy to transport, and everything that I need for a three or four day long range bottom fishing trip is in this one box right here. The top tray, perfect for hand towels, tools, multi-tool, oil grease and lube, a little glue stick for fixing a broken guide on a rod in the event that happens, pliers, some additional cutters. Like I said, all of my tools and my essential gear right on top there. Inside the box, Bubba Blade fillet knife and bait knife, you're gonna need that. I always bring an extra deep drop reel. You never know what may happen, so I always bring an extra one. I don't wanna be caught short-handed out there. Extra power cord, these things fail. Truth of the matter, they fail. Make sure you have an extra power cord. Line, extra monofilament, leader material, plenty of it right here, diamond presentation fluorocarbon, extra braid for my deep drop reels and my snapper and grouper reels, and it's all right here in this one box. Little container, super important. This has got all of my three-way swivels, my barrel swivels, beads, hooks, snap swivels, everything I need to stay rigged up is in this tiny little box right here. So I can pull it out along with the leader material and boom, I can re-rig in a matter of minutes. I'm not, really in a matter of seconds. I'm not fumbling around. I'm not looking for stuff. I've got all of my jigs, all of my vertical jigs and deep water bottom jigs in there as well. There's just tons of lead in the bottom of this box here as well. Plus, even have a couple of extra high speed Wahoo lures up here as well, along with some lights. I mean, like I said, you can see, I just got a ton of stuff in this one box, but it's everything that I need to stay tight. I'm not fumbling around. I'm not bringing extra gear. This is it right here. This is the way to do it right on long range bottom fishing trips. Shark is right behind it, dude. Right behind it. It's a red, big red grouper. Batty, there he is. Nice job. You got him. Right nice. Belly. Sweet. Whew. That's a grouper. Look at that. Okay. Right there, that VMC hook. Every time. Right in the corner of the mouth. But, you know, you can see that hook is in there good. 
But and if watch. you put any slack, that thing can come right out. Come yeah. right, boom. You know, that's why it's so important when you're fighting these big bottom fish, really any fish. Pressure. Uh, constant, constant pressure. There's 15 pound fish. Yeah. Beautiful. That size red grouper doesn't get any bigger. Beautiful, look at this. Fins are all flared out. Eyes are all bugged out from coming up from the deep. But look at that mouth. If you think your hook is too big, you think your bait's too big, look at that mouth. That thing can eat anything. Dude, that thing could suck down a grapefruit even more. Get yourself some of that right there, baby. Yankee cat. Florida Sport Fishing is the number one magazine for the latest tips, tricks, tactics, and techniques. Close to 200 pages, each issue is packed with instructional articles, easy to follow illustrations, and award-winning photography. Only $29.97 for a two-year subscription. For home delivery, visit fsftv.com. Subscribe now and receive a free shirt, unlimited access to our new digital edition, and a special bonus gift. What if navigating was as simple as touch and go? It is that simple. The world's first multi-touch MFD chart plotter, Navnet TZ Touch. Fortress, the world's best anchors. Stronger, faster, lighter. High-tech aluminum alloy makes Fortress anchors the easiest to handle. Precision machining and sharpening results in the fastest setting anchor. Fortress buries deep for the strongest holding power. With eight models from four to 69 pounds, there's a Fortress anchor for you. Fortress, stronger, faster, lighter. Florida Sport Fishing TV proudly endorses and utilizes Boat Outfitters. From replacement parts to hard to find hardware, boat owners and builders turn to BoatOutfitters.com. Salt Life Sport Optics. Ask for them by name and see what you've been missing. Dr. Dan's. From lip balm to sunblock, a complete skincare line designed for life on the water. Tropic Trailer, Florida's largest dealer has the right trailer at the right price. Rugged Shark, technical footwear designed for boating and fishing enthusiasts. You know, the one thing I really wanna stress, if you're coming out here on the Yankee Captains or really any long range trip, most important thing I can tell you is preparation, is being ready for everything. You don't know what conditions you're gonna face. You know, I was anticipating coming out here and spending a lot of time jigging which we've had some really excellent success with, but we're also faced with some deep water, a lot of current. It's taken at least 12 to 16 ounces to stay on the bottom. So I switched over to bait. And as you can see, hooked up to a nice fish right now. But it's really about being ready for everything because you never know what you're gonna encounter. And the conditions change out here, not only from day to day, but literally from hour to hour. So it's the guy that's ready, willing to adapt, and modify his presentation based on really the existing conditions, that's the guy that's gonna go home a winner. Right there, got color. Way, way down there, just see a big, big shape. There it is, big gag. Nice big fat, healthy gag grouper. You can see clearly different, different body shape than the red groupers. Similar, but unique. Different fin structure. Obviously, different coloration. But look at that mouth, look at those teeth right there. You can see that thing is just built for deep water hunting, deep water living. We'll crush crabs, lobsters, shellfish, juvenile fish. And if you look at those jaws, I mean, once that gag right there snatches something, there's absolutely no escape. Pulley Ridge, baby. Want to catch fish like that? Spend the time, spend the money, prepare. Stay at the rail and score big. Right on the bottom. Right on the bottom. Those gold jigs work really good. Hammer jigging. Yeah, beautiful fish, man. 
funny on these darker waters. How the darker they back, are, it's right? It's nice and dark. Yep, I was just saying that, like yep. when you catch them in the Tortugas, how bright and they're pink. Super and, bright pink. Yeah, up here, you can tell they're yep. sitting on they some harder bottom, bottom some darker bottom. Mm-hmm. Somebody's got color right here. Holy Ridge's finest. Nice. Gold on jig. jig. On Goldilocks. Yep. Look at that. What a pretty fish, huh? Look at the colors right on the face right there. Awesome. Great catch, dude. Great catch. Another quality fish on that same jig. When the captain recommends a jig, you fish that jig. You know, I think this trip is an absolutely perfect example that expensive tackle is not required. Is not always gonna lean the odds in your favor, you know? Jigs that are $20 plus, you know, certainly work, but you can buy these traditional hammer jigs for a fraction of that. And as you can see, the majority of the fish that have been caught on jigs today. 95% right have been on this jig. On that jig right there. Let me see if I can make it 96%. <laughs> Got him on, baby, on the jig. Makes it all worthwhile. Nice mutton. You know what? That's a beautiful fish you got yourself there. And we're up in the wheelhouse with Captain Greg Mercurio. Greg, you really pioneered the whole dry tortugas fishery. You were like the first guy out there, weren't you? I mean, tell us a little yeah, bit about that's that. That's right. Beautiful Pulley Ridge Queen. To learn more about the tactics and techniques seen on today's show and to subscribe to Florida Sport Fishing Magazine, visit floridasportfishing.com and get hooked up.